Hello. <clears throat> Hello, good morning. How are we doing today? Um, I love how excited you guys are to attempt a podium in the morning. Especially Rumble, mostly Rumble. Um, Floyd, good to see you. Awake and Dreaming, hi, good morning. Hope you're doing well. Um, is there a concert going on in your house this morning? Is, is Friday also piano morning? Um, wait, no, I'm not muted. Ha! <laughs> Brookfield, hey! How are you doing? You had me worried there for a minute, Floyd, but I definitely checked my levels. It was muted, but then I fixed it. Hey, T-Dog, good morning to you. How are you doing? How are you doing? Ross is here. Everybody's here. Everybody's super prompt on a Friday. I appreciate that. I'm still working through coffee. Um, cold here this morning. Cold. I woke up and I think it was minus three. Which is cold. And then I realized that um, I like super killed my Monstera. If you're into plants at all. Um, I left her outside when we went to Canada. I, I know, I, I knew it was like a, uh, a risk, but it did freeze, and then I just left her out there, and it froze again last night. So, gonna have to chop off all the leaps, and maybe I can propagate it from a node, but we'll see. Sleepy morning for Schnookums. Oh, and then he's doing science. Oh, great! I, I love that he's going to do science. It's, it's a good day for science. Um, am I able to do emotes? I am not. Not until you activate um, affiliate. However, if you have better Twitch TV, I did make some silly ones of my face. Um, so if you, if you use better Twitch TV, um, that extension, I think there's four or five there. Floyd can probably show you. Hey, Tarth. There they are. That's my face doing weird things. Thank you, Floyd. Good morning, Darth. Love, I love your cactar. Who says that? Doctor, is that yours? Is that your own cactar? Oh, so good. Okay, let's switch over to the game. Let's get this shit going. I know, Doc Freck is good. Wait, why can't you see the game? Oh, there it is. Okay. Such a cute puppers. I'm gonna have one more sip of this before we get going. Okay. So, make it two sips. <laughs> oh, fuck. Still recovering from the trip home. Honestly, like, the hardest part from the trip home was sitting for that long. My hip flexors, so mad at me. They were so mad at, like, at the end of both days, I was just like, I cannot sit. I cannot sit anymore. You had some help. Yeah, I think, like, I'm excited about that part. Um, because obviously I, I mean, I just took photos of myself and then cropped them. I don't have artistic talent like that. Um, hey, Juxta, happy Friday, Illamon, happy Friday to you. But, but over long drives is a thing for sure. Um, so yes, where are we? We can head to Ibsen's castle, but I think we were doing more chocoboing. And what I was going to ask, which if you remember, at the very end of last stream, the Moogle in this forest was like, hey, there's another forest. It's in this direction. And I don't remember what direction that was. So if you do, I would love, I would love the answer, yes. Um, I'm going to get in my ship, I think. And like Southwest, maybe? If I wasn't a goofy looking dude, I would do most of myself. Like you mean just pictures of yourself or um, Southwest? Pictures of yourself or would you, I mean, can you draw? Can you draw, Darth? Southwest. Oh fuck, I always do this. The game is just so loud. I'm gonna do that every stream. We're gonna adjust our volumes. So there's not a lot southwest. It 
Stop. Uh, okay, wait, 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 wait. How do I go down again? Rancor, hey, happy new year to you. How are you doing? Okay, we are here. Um, yeah, I was back Wednesday. This is the second one, second stream back. Uh... I don't, I don't know what I'm looking for here. I mean, I don't see anything here. I don't even see tracks, but we're fighting. Um, in the water is a crack. Oh wait, you see the hole there. Oh, I did not see the hole there. We can go back and look. Work has been crazy, uh, um, but like good or, or crazy bad. This is a big dragon. That seems like overkill. Dragon. Oh, can you grind levels here? I don't know. This guy is gonna just like fuck me up, isn't he? Okay, he did thunder, so let's not do thunder on him. I don't want to fight the dragon. Does Quinn have good blue magic? Uh, what's good? Uh, I mean, this is what, it, what what they have. White wind, vanish, night. I did a mighty guard. We can holy it. Oh, I've never tried this yet. Hey, coach. Good morning, or good afternoon to you. Hope you've had a great day so far. There's one very good blue magic for these guys. I won't say which. Is it one that I have? Because that wasn't great. No, I don't have it. Fair enough. I also kind of want to eat it. Let's try to eat it. I don't know how- it's probably not low enough yet. I- yeah. I- I actually- I really like eating enemies. It's kind of like- I mean, it's cool that they get the skill, but then- Oh, is it dead? Oh. But then it's also just like... Like a super insult, if that makes sense. Like, we're fighting. But instead of killing you properly, I'm just gonna eat you. So... Yeah. I don't know. Feels... It feels good. But we didn't get to eat the dragon, because the dragon died. Uh, better use Quinn now, as going back to get these later is pain for... Oh, oh, my 100% run, Floyd. My 100% run. Okay, wait, you said there was a crack in the ocean, but I assume I need a chocobo to do that. So let's get in our ship. It looks like there's like at least lagoon around this entire place. Oh no, there isn't. Oh, there's there. Yeah, we can get through there. So, okay, these are tracks. This is this is where I am choosing to go. Oh, you said right island. This is the different this is the left island, but I think that's this is okay. Unless you meant correct island. Correct island. <laughs> the left one is the right island. Okay, and now we are running back to the crack in the water, which I did not see, but I trust is there. Can I get around this way? Uh, nope. Not. Who's on first? Oh boy. 
Oh, we have to go like all the way around? Going on an adventure. Uh, nope, not this way. I assume that I, I do want to make my way back down to the bottom there, because you got excited about that island. Oh, fuck, but how do we... Was that... Was that even connected? Like... This feels wrong. But let's see how it plays out. I mean, that's good. This is a good connection. Okay, I'm also relying on you, chat. This is it, right? Is this where I was? Asked it. Asked it. Oh, oh, is it this? In here? Is this a thing? <gasps> All right, I'm also relying on chat to just tell me when it's time to stop doing chocobos. You know, like, I don't, I, just, just tell me when it's time. I don't, I don't want to chocobo too long. Okay, because remember that time when we fought Tonberries for a while and, um, we didn't follow through on that, and we fought Tonberries for too long. All right, Mean, what are you doing here? I'm Choco's buddy, Kupo. He knows what we need to do. Let's dig around some more, Kupo. It's tougher to dig in bottom, in bottom of lagoon than it is in forest. We can only dig in the shallow parts. Choco doesn't like to go in deep water, so the area is limited, Kupo. Um. I'll make it half time and half price. Okay. I would like to play. Yeah. Play. Yeah, I am I understand. Umbolt, hello. Welcome. Hope you're having a great day. Oh god. Come on. Oh my, it's so deep. Quote it. We're never gonna get another one. Yeah, definitely, definitely a weak beak. Uh, we're gonna work on that though. We're gonna become a better chocobo. Gotta work on that beak power and go deep. Strong beaks go deep. There's a joke here, right? There's something a joke about deepness and maybe hardness. I don't know. You guys can make it. A weak beak sounds like a diss. You come in here with that weak beak, Brookfield? Oh my gosh. Come on, the area is small. We gotta get an exclamation point somewhere in here, right? No. Oh, the entrance counts? Oh my god. We'll never get there. Half time feels so bad, even with the smaller, like, area. <laughs> Floyd's on board for a full Chocobo stream. This is now going to be three hours of Chocobo hot and cold. Um, just so you know what you've signed up for. Not that you can't leave at any point anyways. That's how Twitch works. God. Get it? Come on. Come on, bird. Fuck. So precise. Or... What a waste. Oh, we did it. Uh. Come on, Chocobo. Uh. Okay. <laughs> Three hour just Chocobo stream. Are the creatures here like Pokemon? Um, no, not really. I mean, you get a Chocobo. You can summon a Chocobo with, with the greens. And then... 
I don't fully know. What does this do? Oh, no, I don't want to do that. I don't fully know, but my Chocobo has evolved, leveled up. Like, he's blue now, right? He was yellow. And blue means he can go in the water. Where? Oh, we got one! Yes! Really need that beak level up. <laughs> okay, so should I keep digging? Do we go after that single? Maybe we get a couple first before we head back out? I'm gonna go again. I'm gonna go again. Awake and dreaming. I'm trying to think of what the dog creature was. What was the dog creature? What did I do last stream? Anyone have opinions on SMT5? Um, I want it, but I don't have an opinion. I had it on my like wish list and I was gonna buy it when I came back because it was sitting at $35. And then it went back up to $45 and I didn't buy it. But I think it would be something that I like. Oh my gosh, this is unbelievable. It's so difficult to get two, a two in one. Ross, I, I just know someone mentioned it in here before. And I looked it up and I was like, yes. Yes, that sounds like something I would like. I put it on my birthday, birthday list. Or maybe I'll just buy it for myself because I'm an adult. But I think, I think now that I've seen it sit at $35 for so long, I'm definitely going to wait till it goes down again. Oh, come on. Ugh, it's not great. Oh yeah, I have so many games. I'm sitting on so many games right now. Not even just like the games that I want to stream, um, which is everything, literally everything on that list, which is years <laughs> of, of play. Um, but so I'm I'm still playing Dragon Quest Eleven, which I which I talked to Cal about. I did play a bit more of it yesterday, like privately, off stream. I mean, privately sounds weird. Um, but then I got I got near Automata for Christmas. Que hey meaty bread. And I got ooh yes, strong beak. I got Death Stranding, which I know, like, maybe, like, isn't everyone's taste, but I wanted to try it. Um, got Final Fantasy X, but that I will play on stream. Um, I also grabbed, like, stuff on sale. So, I just, there's a lot of things. There's a lot of things I want to play right now. But then, like... You didn't finish it, but it's really cool. Yeah, I've, I've heard a lot of mixed things, but I just was too curious. I had to try it. I want to try it. So I waited. I mean, I got it. I, it was a gift, but I waited until it wasn't full price. However, I just feel like I'm not going to have a lot of gaming time next week because GDQ starts. Who else has GDQ hype? Yeah, GDQ starts on Sunday. Sunday around noon, depending on your depending on your time zone. Pretty excited about that. It's gonna be a good week next week. Yeah, I think it's 
It's noon Eastern. What's GDQ? Um, game's done quick. It is a week-long speedrunning charity stream. Hey, Fred. Good morning. How are you? Do a co-stream? Yeah, Juxta, if you Google Games Done Quick, I think it's literally gamesdonequick.com. They have a schedule out um, for what games will be run when. They will be live streaming for the whole week. And um, it's just, it's good fun. Even if, I find even if I don't know the game, if it's a good runner with good commentation, commentation, whatever, let it happen. Um, it's good to watch. It's, it's a good time and it's for charity. So you can donate um, all through the week. It used to be a really good event, but now it's not the same. Do you mean that because it's online now as opposed to being in person? Or do you actually think there have been changes through the years to like the format and other things that you're not super or as pleased with, I guess? Yeah, there's a death loop run. That's day one, I think, right? The format and the feel of the show? Okay, fair enough. I mean, I still really enjoy it. I've been watching it for years. And we usually will do a donation, like find a block that has like a, a prize that maybe we're interested in winning, even though we never win a prize, but <clears throat> I just love it. It's it's always, I mean, it's two weeks of, of my year that I know are going to be great. <clears throat> I see they're running um, Final Fantasy 13. I think that's Monday, no, Tuesday morning. I know that that's not a popular Final Fantasy with this group. I don't know that I can speak to that, Meaty. Um, I don't really want to get into an argument about that. I don't know enough about the runners in the categories to say whether, like how the, the runners were chosen. <clears throat> but the people, you also have to apply to run on it, right? So it's possible that the chosen person was the best applicant, you know? You have to submit a run to be reviewed to be able to get on the show. But there's nothing wrong with representation either. Or maybe, maybe they're just a better commentator or a more exciting runner to watch. I don't know. Check your registry. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Fred. Um, I appreciate that. And, and I'm excited. And you're awesome. And Merry Christmas to you as well. I, I did think you were serious. Or should I, like, not check it? And then it could be a surprise. We've gotten only one so far, right? I've only been kind of paying attention and just mostly... Yes, not check it. <laughs> I don't know what Forbidden Memories in is, Cal. When is that one? Fair enough, Meaty. Yeah, totally fair enough. I, I do think they are a little... Well, I don't know. I, I know that they have... Like, kind of almost a clique of... GDQers who are always involved and maybe they get a preference as to whether they're doing a run or oh my god or not but I I don't know I tend to like those people anyways so it doesn't make me mad we're not gonna get this Friday the 14th what time ish there are certain people who get to be in it every year usually because they're big yeah exactly I, I agree with you Floyd I've noticed that on their their channel as well, which I don't watch too, too often. I, I actually really like watching The First Step, which is a Thursday night show. This Oh, this feels like a good one. And it's Keys and, and Hobbs. Oh, it was a good one. Keys and Hobbs do like first time speedruns of a game. 
then they get like eight hours practice before they start and then they just go for it and race oh I feel like I can do this six seconds come on chocobo no oh yeah beak stronger Did GDQ Bank cosplayer was it puppets? I can't remember. I don't know about either of those things. I do remember watching a, like the Final Fantasy VII remake run and the guy absolutely dressed up as Cloud. Eight forty-seven a.m. on the Friday. Forgotten memories or for forbidden memories. Okay, I don't know that game, but I will be streaming, so I'll miss it. And you'll you'll be not here because you'll be watching it. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, controversy aside, I think it's a great event. It's really fun to watch. I like. We generally just keep it on in the living room, and we pop in and out. And we'll yell orb, you know, when necessary. You, if you get that joke, we're probably best friends. Or not joke, reference. <laughs> People get it. <laughs> yes, yes, that's that's correct, Bodcap. That's exactly the run I'm talking about. That guy, he dressed up. Also, yes, also good morning. Um, okay, how much chocoboing are we doing? We did two, we got two. Should we still, I mean, I got, we've done half an hour of chocoboing now. Going again. <clears throat> you can check them, check them with mean. Okay, we'll do it after here. Hey, Silverhawk. Chocobo hot and cold is like Pringles. Is like Pringles? Like, you just can't fit your hand to the bottom? Has anyone- has anyone seen that, uh... <laughs> that was like a low-key Bo Burnham reference. Has anyone seen that special? And he- he has a whole song about how he can't fit his hand inside a Pringles can. Like, they must employ engineers, you know, product engineers, design- <laughs> Yeah, I wish I had a daughter. <laughs> And then she could reach to the bottom of the Pringles can for you, right? Oh, once you pop, you can't stop. No, I have heard that. I have heard that. That was also in Canada. Um, <laughs> just flip it upside down, but then, then the crummies come out, right? Okay, I want to check my choco grass, but the crumbs, exactly. <laughs> Is that that's the same one like uh about burritos, right? Okay, we got a couple lagoon ones. That's where your mouth is. <laughs> like definitely reaching maximum burrito capacity. Um It's near Should I we have we have 3, I think. Oh wait. Yeah, we have 3 more. One of those is right outside. Shouldn't have got the lettuce. Oh, that it, shouldn't have got the lettuce if I knew it wouldn't fit, right? Also, lettuce on a burrito, very questionable choice. Because do you really want hot lettuce? I don't. I don't want hot lettuce. Okay, we got a piece. How many pieces make a chocograph? I personally don't put lettuce on my burritos. Eh, said it. Hot lettuce is basically spinach? Um, so lettuce goes in after the hot stuff though. Here's the thing. Here's the thing, and like, I understand your your reference there, Floyd, about putting lettuce on a burger. When I get a burrito, 
they put all my like there's hot stuff in it obviously the things are hot before they go in the burrito however usually after they wrap it they like put it on a press or whatever right they get it all hot and stuff again at least that's my personal burrito experience so then yes like the lettuce cooks it's fucking weird Do I put lettuce on a burger? Absolutely. But I also don't like put my burger then in a panini press. Everyone knows burrito bowls are superior. I do like the burrito bowl. Ah, oh, yeah. Strong beak. Meaty bread. Steamed lettuce with a Sunday roast. Gross. Yeah, hot lettuce is weird. But I, I do like... Okay, wait. Can I... So one of these you said is right outside. Let's take a look. Um... It's near a city where night never ends. Oh, I don't know what that means. Juxta, I hope you're kidding. Boiled lettuce. Doesn't have enough structure. Oh, right. Press and select. It feels really far away if your chocobo isn't grown up. Is that like a, a Neverland reference? Hmm. Silverhawk, you don't have to tell me. I think I'm going to try to do one of these. Well, now we're on to cabbage. Okay. Cabbage, very different. I wouldn't... Well, I was going to say I wouldn't put cabbage on a burger. I would if it was a slaw. I don't know where the fuck that is. I know where this one is. But I couldn't get to it last time. Let's see if we can get there. Um. Yeah, you leave for five minutes more on the cabbage. Did you miss the lettuce? The lettuce chat? We also talked about lettuce. I'm gonna see if I can get to this. I'm gonna have to remember how we got here. I generally like cabbage. Um, I love a good slaw, like on a taco. Especially fish tacos. Uh, yeah, fish tacos with slaw. But I also just like, like I will chop up. I, oh no, I can't go this way. Fuck. I will chop up lettuce. Not, no, not lettuce. Um, cabbage. Load it with fucking butter. Maybe an onion. Hit it, like, stick it in your cast iron pan. Oven. 375 for an hour. You're welcome. Um, just, I don't think I can get to this one. Or if I can, uh, it's around the outside. Around the outside. For me, it's eating uncooked dry pasta. Wait. Steph, thanks for the follow. Wait, are you saying you like to eat dry uncooked pasta or like that's the thing you hate as much as hot lettuce? Where the fuck am I going? I'm so lost. This isn't the chocograph for me. You like it. Like you'll just grab a bowl like you would like a bowl of chips and just eat a bowl of dry pasta? Yeah, like chips. Okay, this isn't it. I'm sorry, wait. When making, when I'm making pasta, I nipple too. What you got there? What you got there, Brookfield? The picture that looks like brown sandy plateaus. No, it does, it does. I know, Solo, I know. Taco Nexus, hi. Wait, is, is Steph is Steph known? Um, should, should I? 
What about this one? I don't know where this is either. <laughs> oh, food talk is like maybe I don't, you know, at least 30% of what we do here. And so now that you're here, Steph, I have to ask you your opinion on hot lettuce, because that is the main topic. Fuck. Okay, right, so it looks like this, yeah? Like, it looks like this. And I really thought that we had flown past this before. And, but I think it's a bit north of here, which I don't think I can get to. Because this is a dead end. Hot lettuce, I'm calling the police. Warranted. Perfectly warranted. That's the right response to the hot lettuce debacle. Okay, I don't know where this is. Um, or like, I don't know how to get there. Maybe I need to get on my airship. I especially don't know where this one is. If anyone wants to... I mean... Is it this thing? Looking at it from the other way? No, that doesn't look right. Is it that one? If anyone's annoyed at me randomly walking around in my chocobo... You can definitely say something about it. Like, hey, streamer. You're not being smart right now. Oh my gosh. Wait, you eat spoons of cold gravy? Mm. I'm, like, I'm a bit judging you right now. Not like... I don't know. Just, just like warm it up though, and put it on some fries with some cheese, right? <laughs> Fuck no, I can't go anywhere. You know what? Fuck it. We're going back. None of these chocographs are good chocographs. <laughs> None of them. Oh, I, I, I'm not telling you to waste your gravy. Not telling you to waste it. I'm telling you to cook something, make your gravy hot again, and um, put the hot gravy on that cooked thing. Like, I have a pot of gravy in my fridge right now because I made... I made beef cheeks last night in the pressure cooker, and then we did, like, a red wine gravy with them. And, man, there was a fuck ton of gravy. Um, God damn it. So, yeah, there's a pot of gravy in there. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I'm not going to eat it with a spoon directly from the bowl. Hold. That's definitely what I'm not going to do. <laughs> hot lettuce is not good. I do not enjoy hot lettuce on a burger. I do not en enjoy it on a girder. <laughs> we also do rhymes. I think, uh, yeah, Steph... 100%. You're right. Hot lettuce. Not good. Oh, gravy straw. Oh my god. Just grab the pot. Grab one of those, like, thick... Like a bubble tea straw, right? So you can especially get, like... Ah, nice. We got another one. Like, the chunkies through there. Ugh. Um, and yeah, that's probably lunch for meaty bread. I do like kimchi. I like kimchi. Kimchi's good. Good snack. A hollow parsnip! Oh my god! <laughs> please, please make that happen. I would, I would like to see that. You make that happen, Podcap, and you stream it. That's how you get, that's how you get all the follows and, and stuff. Parsnip gravy stream. But yeah, it's a party taco. If that's what it takes, <laughs> gotta give the people what they want. Oh, 
I mean, that's that's essentially what I had last night, Steph. Um, I made I made the beef cheeks in the pressure cooker, and then from like the juices and the wine and whatever that was around it, I made the gravy, and then uh, yeah, with beef stock and whatever onions, carrots, etc. A little bit of a mirepoix, if you fancy. Um, um, and then we ate that like over mashed potatoes, which was great. It's a good call, although. Like, I'm not sure how I feel about beef cheeks still. I bought them because, like, all the cooking shows that I watch seem to think they are fancy and delicious. And mostly they were just fatty. And they, they did taste good. They still tasted fine. But I there was a lot of waste of the, the most fatty bits, which I don't like. Didn't like that. We're not going to get this one. Okay, but we got another choco graph, so maybe we should just look at that first. I will dip stuff in cold gravy, but the, if there is nothing to dip, I will get the spoon. What's your favorite thing to dip in cold gravy? Meaty bread. So with butternut squash, sweet potato, onion garlic, um... Steph, you're invited anytime. Anytime you can come and make that for me. That sounds delicious. I would like to check my chocograph. Um, this is the new one, right? I hear there's sunken treasure near a peninsula in the southern part. Well, that sounds... That sounds closer to me, right? Let's go see if we can do that one. Oh, we were talking about... Food chat is continuing. Um, Noel and I were talking about our favorite pastas, like pasta dishes that we've had in our lives, essentially. Um, because I love pasta. Um, would eat it all the time. Like that, that, that's absolutely a comfort food for me. But Noel's kind of like, meh. Like, whatever, pasta will never be my favorite. So I was like, okay, well, what's your favorite dish that you've had with pasta? It's a stretch. It would be a stretch for me to say that that is what I'm looking at here. And there was a... I had a butternut squash ravioli somewhere. And I forget where it was. It was a restaurant. It was in Canada. Um, and it was like butternut squash ravioli, but topped with like goat's cheese and like candied pecans and maybe a burnt butter sage sauce, sage burnt butter sauce. It was awesome. It was awesome. That's maybe my best pasta experience. Um, penne vodka? Yes, please. You're going to be hard pressed to find a pasta dish that I'm not going to want. I am again, this is also not where I want to be. This, I don't see these shapes of land formations here. I probably should get in my ship and um, actually look. That being said, for like the uh, a simple pasta dish, like fettuccine Alfredo all day, all day. I love it. I love me uh, like bechamel sauce, like yeah. Cheese and pasta, better love store than Twilight. You know what? Like, that's a really low bar that you've set yourself. Um, even though you are correct. Oh, you're a huge fan of egg noodles. Okay, so... So, like... My mom used to make egg noodles all the time as just, like, a side. I'm gonna get in here. I'm gonna get on this. And it would just be egg noodles, like, butter maybe some parm and she was gonna make that as a side when we were at home for christmas and my husband was like egg noodles like that's not it's not a thing and i was like motherfucker that's absolutely a thing Ooh, egg noodles for that beef cheeks beef cheeks too kind of like make it a stroganoff but not mmm ah also, m many apologies to Awaken Dreaming, who is intermittent fasting and experiencing 
all our, all of our food chat. Okay, looking for squiggles. Looking for a squiggly, squiggly coastline here. Look at me driving. Wait, no food till three? Ugh, rumble. Ooh. Oh, you're, I, I just read your, how do you say that? Something, something with pepper, right? Okay, so this is definitely the one. I definitely have this chocograph. It's not the one I'm showing right now, but there's something here. And I think I was here before and I could not figure out how to get into the water from here. <laughs> yeah, let's all decide what Awakened Dreaming is going to eat today as their one meal. So this is all connected. What we need here is a beach. That is not a beach. Oh, but is this, is this this one? No, that's not, it's not bumpy enough. How fucking good is pasta, though? Damn right. Uh, oh my gosh. Okay. None of these are the right way. I don't know how to get into the water. That does not... That could be right. Maybe if we look at it from the other way. Let's take a look at that. Nah, that's not it. That doesn't look right. Fucking shit. Okay, this sucks. I suck. I don't know where anything is. Hey, Metal Giga. Good morning, good afternoon. Happy time zones. Hope you're having a great day so far. We are mostly lost. Well, I mean, we're not lost. There's a map, but it's not, this is not it. I've looped this entire continent almost and not found what I'm looking for. All that food and all that booze. Okay, let's, um... So we've done a loop. We've done a loop. And I'm still kind of focused on this area, right? Like, this area is a thing. There's something here. But I don't know how to get into the water here. <laughs> You're right, Bodcap. And... I feel like there's no connected beach. So maybe I'm not supposed to get that one yet? I don't know. Fuck. Fuck! What have I done now? <laughs> what would you include in homemade dog food? Oh, we're, we're talking animal science now? Um... As an animal nutritionist, I would say you can find good information on the internet. Just like, I think the most important thing to remember is that your dog is an omnivore. Also, look at this. Look what I'm doing here. I made that decision. Um, your dog's an omnivore. So as much as you think like they want to eat all meats all the time, they need more than that. Hasn't learned shell yet. But if you if you really want like like an actual breakdown, I don't know those things by heart. I did take a pet nutrition course, but um, my specialty is actually agricultural animals. 
not pets. But there's some really good... I mean, there's some really good animal nutrition. I, I don't know if that's good. But that's kind of cool. Okay, wait. Friends. Friends. <laughs> Your dog needs pasta too. You made some dog food. I don't wonder squash with boiled chicken. Mm, I wonder if that has enough fat in it. Weird dog. Okay, I need help. I'm asking for help. What should I do? Where should we go? Should I go back and get more chocographs? I don't know how to get to any of the ones that I have. Lasagna for cats. <laughs> Is your cat named Garfield? Um, speaking of cats, I guess difference cats and dogs. Your cats do have a higher protein requirement than, than dogs. Fuck, I forgot this again. We have to go loop around. Um, yeah, Silverhawk, do I have one that I can currently get? Or... Or should I just get more? Yeah, your cats cats have a higher protein requirement do than dogs, so like you cannot feed your cat dog food. It won't. It will not meet its requirements. Oh, okay. Let's go. Let's go talk to the. Oh, the Moogle will tell me. Okay. And you know what? We love hot and cold, so we'll. We'll go play. And that's also why um, dogs might think that cat shit is like a good, good snacky time. Um, high protein content. Today you learned. Yes, I do. The Dawn Lagoon one. Okay. Don't remember what that one was. I've noticed that dogs like all forms of shit. There you go, Rumble. We're turning it around. You're not hungry anymore. Talking about shit. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna do some more digging. Helping. We're helping the intermittent fasters in here. Aw oh, man, Freckles. Like, we don't have a cat anymore. We used to have a cat. And man, that cat poop was like a special treat. Let me tell you. <laughs> I think a cup of tea will suffice. Uh... Maybe, maybe we don't talk about shit snacks anymore. We have gone too far. I, I just realized I actually have to talk to him, right? Like, he's not just going to say, by the way, there's no more chocographs here. You've dug too much, right? I should. He actually has. Does he actually have text? Can you imagine if he was like, maybe you should go do something else? Like, there's more to this game than Chocobo Hot and Cold. And I'll be like, are you sure, though? Like, is there really. I almost don't want to find it now because I don't have time to dig it up. Okay, have a great lunch, Steph. Happy to have you here. Um, 
I'm on into I'm on for another couple hours. Nine till noon, central. <laughs> Taco, hey, thanks for the follow. Um <laughs> Game is chocobo on gold with some battles and drama in between. That seems seems right. So I guess I guess he doesn't have anything to say yet. So we'll just keep digging. How deep was this? Is this a good one? Not a good one. That was lucky. Come on. An ore. So, um, we started playing Bloomhaven, the digital version, on Wednesday night. It is like very well implemented. And I don't know I don't know if my expectations were low or what, but it worked really well. And we beat the first level. The cards fucking betrayed us. Yeah, it really felt like um the the attack modifier decks felt bad. Like, we, we drew so many zeros, and there really should only be one in each deck. Unless it was a, like, a special... I know some of the scenarios alter your, your attack decks, but... I didn't think that was... I think that was one of them, and it didn't say that it was. And, and even when you hovered over your character, it shows your attack modifier deck. And I didn't think... I still only saw, like, the one do, you know, denoting. I hate it when it's out here. Denoting, like, my zero times. Whatever. We beat it, and that's all that matters. Moving on to scenario two. Que? Ah, oh, tease. Tease que. I knew it too. Like, once it gets down to three seconds, I should just stop. Because I know I can't reach that. Yet. Oh, that was pretty deep. Or. <gasps> yeah! Ah. Beak so hard. I mean, we are getting a lot of shit. I just... Maybe we go and get the one that Silverhawk says we can get. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Not gonna make it. Ah, oh, three. Three. All right, it's been an hour of Chocobos now. I will say... I do want to do some story today. <laughs> I'm not doing three hours of Chocobo Hot and Cold. We're gonna go to the castle. Where are you in the story? Um, we're about to go to, is it Ibsen's castle? Why not? Uh, it does, I don't know. I would just like to see, I would like to feel a bit of progression. So, uh, what happened? Uh, dagger cutter hair. That was kind of the last, I'm going to call that the last major plot point. It's not a major plot point. She cut her hair and we're going to 
the castle. Got it. The castle was, I think it was this way, right? I think it's on the continent near me, maybe? Oh, right, she can talk again. Fuck yeah. And fight, yeah, and be useful. Right, she like evolved as a person, evolved through her grief and cutting her hair was the, like the symbol of that happening. Come on, six seconds. We got this? We got this. Ugh. Yes, we are near the castle. Okay. One more? Okay, one more. This is gonna be it. This is our last one. And then we're gonna go get the one that... that we can get to. And then... maybe we'll go to the castle. I would just really like to- I would like to finish this off with one more chocograph. That would feel nice. Only one more. Just one more time. Just one more chapter. I say that and then I also said like, I can- yeah, I can stop any time, guys. It's not a problem. It's not a problem. Although I- yeah, I actually- that might be a lie because I would like to get just one more chocograph. Fucking where is this one? doesn't matter. I lied. I lied. I'm doing it again. Don't at me. Because I want one more chocograph. Yeah, that's exactly what I meant, zombie. Zombie knows. I don't have a problem. I guess, like, if I really wanted to do this, three hours later... How would the intervention go? Let's play that out. Please give me an intervention on Chocobo Hot and Cold. I can stop anytime. Oh god. <laughs> I told myself I was gonna watch five more minutes ten minutes ago. <laughs> uh, taco. I didn't get one. He's using me to level up his beak. I mean, I want, I, I appreciate his, his level, his beak leveling up. We just want to say this is not an attack on you, but we're worried. Okay, good start, Ross. Love that. What are you worried about? I can stop any time. Look at all the treasures I'm digging up. See, I, I really needed those greens. I'm lucky that I played one more time. Fifty gil, totally worth it. See, this this round paid for itself right there. It's not a problem. Two seconds, absolutely not gonna happen. Fifteen. I. It's just. Uh, I want one more. I want one more choker grab. Also, what do I do with chocograph pieces? Do I have to actively do something with those? Pieces are... Pieces are hints. Oh, I didn't see what that was. That wasn't a chocograph, though, was it? Was it? It wasn't. Was the last time you spent your guilt in something other than the scam removal? 
Uh, no, I did buy things. I bought things and 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 synthesized things at the last location, which was the library. And I got um, Zidane got a new sword. S see, yeah, I don't only I don't only do chocobo hot and gold. It's not a problem. Come on. It's not it, Chocobo. Oh, that was a good one. It's not very deep, though. Echo screen. Ugh. Okay, I don't think there's any... I think the... Can we do one more? <laughs> Balan Genesis, hi. <laughs> How are you today? Welcome on in to Chocobo Hot and Cold, the stream. I'm not, I'm not even drinking my coffee. I'm not even drinking my coffee because I'm so into chocobos. Like, this is cold now. This is I've done this to myself. Last one, says zombie. All right. Let's make it a good one. And then we'll go to that place. I've got a good feeling about this one or the next five. Fuck. <laughs> hey, Sasha. How are you today? Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Get it. Get it. Fuck. Shit. No. I'm leaving. There, I said it. I'm leaving. I can leave. I can leave. My choice. My choice to leave. Okay. Okay. No, no sad face. You said last- you said last one. Okay, we're looking for this. Which... I'm gonna try to go, like, just a bit north. Oh. <laughs> you meant chocograph. Okay, so, like, what's that? Like, a sliver of land? The hint was, like, the place where it's night all the time? Is that right? And I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know what that means. Near a city where night never ends. Did we go anywhere where night never ends? TensorFlow, hello. How are you today? Welcome on in. Uh, we're, we've been doing chocobos for an hour. City that never sleeps is Treno. Oh, wait, select for a second hint. Lots of rich people live there. It's been, it's honestly, it's been too long. I don't even remember, like, the bad streamer. I don't even remember what, what happened in Treno. God. Condi PT, I'll never forget, though. I also have no idea where Treno is, obviously. it's new york the city that never sleeps ah new york okay treno's over here let's go um let's go on a let's go on a trip your favorite tent your favorite tensorflow it is many people's favorite that is why we're playing it so this this stream runs on democracy so if you scroll down you can have your say in what i play next and if there is something that you think I should play, um, because I, I probably haven't played it. I've not played a lot of these older classic games, which is what we are doing now. It's kind of the... It's, it's kind of my gimmick. I don't know, it feels weird to call it a gimmick. That's what we're doing. I'm playing classic games that I've never played. 
before. So, if you have a suggestion, feel free to let her go. We are up to the part of the story. Okay, so. Dagger just cut her hair. We're going to Ibsen's castle. Is it that? Everyone vote crisis core. Also, like, don't worry if it doesn't make it this time. It, it's not like it gets removed from the list. This looks right. Okay, let's, uh, let's go set down over here. Yeah, I think this is just a... Oh no, I should have landed on Chocobo. Shit. Where do I get a fucking Chocobo? Back in the ship. Somewhere around here? So hard to see. Is that Trax? Who are my main four? Oh. I don't... I think I have like a main three, maybe. Okay, we're gonna go here. Like, Vivi for life, obviously. And then like, I've taken a liking to, but I, this is who's in my party right now, but pro I should probably switch Dagger and Ico, and then that would be it. Um, I just really like, I think Quinn is really interesting. I was playing Freya for a bit. Oh, I'm sorry, Taco. I did, I, I did just do that because I was thinking like, oh, Dagger doesn't do shit anymore, but now she does do shit again. So she can come back in the party, I guess, you know? Um, is it, do you think it's like out here in the water? Like this looks right, right? Let's, let's do, I mean, does the lineup of the picture matter? Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay. Hey, treasure chest! <sighs> Getting sleepy. Yay! You like fishing, play Breath of Fire 3 or 4. On the emulator, you have input lag. Ooh. I love this shit. This is great. Like, let's go. It's a trap! Wait, it's a trap? This is not a trap. It's not a trap. We've been here before. Okay, what? What do we got now? Oh, Chocobo Overlord. <laughs> Wanderer, we await your return. Choco, you now have the ability to climb mountains. Interesting. Where do I use that? Where do I use that? Okay. We did that one. I haven't found that land piece yet. I don't know where that is either. Probably on a mountain. Thank you. Thank you, Taco. But none of these are mountains, I guess is more what I was saying. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Proteus, thanks for the thanks for the host. Hope you're doing well. I don't know where these are. I know where this is. I don't know how to get there. I don't know where this one is. If anyone um if anyone wants to advise, that's cool. Otherwise, I'm going back to my ship. Uh and we're gonna go to the castle. Unless unless you have other feelings. So when the chocobo like squeeze like that, does that mean anything? 
I said squeeze, it's quite obviously a queer. What is wrong with me? Or is it just, it's just exciting. It's not like signaling. Yeah, okay. He's just like, fuck yeah, we're on a trip. Okay. Getting off Chocobo. Oh, it's just part of the song? Okay. I was, I was trying to, trying to over-interpret it, I guess. <laughs> Castle Greens for life, bitches! Okay, wait. I think I need to look at my map. Is this place on my map? That's not it. Is this it? No. This- was it on my map? Oh no, it's up here! Okay, this is where we're going. Here we go. This is definitely a bop. It just- it feels very epic. Is that it? It's gotta be it. Oh, oh, I have a thought. No, get back in the ship. I want to change my party. Dagger's coming back. Sir? Okay, dagger's back. And then we're probably, we're probably gonna tent. Oh, uh, this area can be tricky. Oh no. Tent and save on the overworld, and then we'll go into the castle. Got a plan. Uh, uh. The world's longest front steps. There's no way this is the final dungeon. Yeah. If I mean, not that I know. I don't know. Um, but just the vibe that I've been getting from from chat as far as like how far I am. Uh, enter. Also, yeah, this didn't really feel climaxy. Second is Hellblade. Final Fantasy XII Zodiac Age. Do people... Is twelve the one people don't like? No, that's 13. This is the old castle Hilda's told, Hilda told us about. Is this the old castle Hilda told us about? This is very long steps. Yeah. What a strange looking place. It's like it's upside down or something. Hmm. It's like mirrored. Oh, look at us all here. All right, I'll take three of you with me. The rest of you secure this spot. Do I prefer playing this how it looks on an original PS1? Um, I, I have to say, Proteus, this is the only experience that I have. Um. I guess I did specifically choose to play it um, not on a remastered version, I guess. And no, I'm not playing on original hardware. We are emulating today. Um, I own this on, on PlayStation. I had it on my PS3, which I can't get to connect to the internet. So, hey Zidane, what's up Amarant? I work alone. I always have, always will. I don't know why you bother carrying dead weight all the time. This guy. What's your point? I'm saying working alone beats working in a team any day and I'm gonna prove it. Okay. Hilda said there's some key here to break the seal, am I right? Yeah. Let's see who finds it first. I'll be going by myself, of course. Amaranth, you selfish, ignorant fool. Calm down, Rusty. 
but... I mean, I'm not gonna tell him what to do. You do you, mate. Okay. It's not like he was gonna be part of the team anyways. I don't know what you're thinking, but if it's what you want, it's okay by me. Well, aren't you an agreeable fellow? I think it's technically called HD port. Well, see you later. Alright. Are you sure about this, Zidane? What can I do? I can't change the way he thinks. Yeah, that felt natural. I, I, that would have felt mean if I had said, nah, like, don't do your own thing. Let's get going, everyone. We'll beat Amaranth at his own game. Uh, yep. This is it. This is the party. I guess we, we just go right up the stairs. Yeah, I did see you playing 13, Fred. Um, just came out at the wrong time. Maybe. 13 is the best Kappa. I see your Kappa. Um, T Tifa is best girl, actually. I mean, I don't know who Fran is, so I can't. I don't, I don't have the full scope. I, I own 13. I own it. And 13 too. Um, I, I started playing it long, long time ago. Avoid 13 as much as possible. Oh, there's no way we can eat him yet. <laughs> Leandra played Final Fantasy 13. I mean, it'll, it'll be up to you. I can add it to the list. I can certainly add it to the list. It's whether or not it gets chosen, right? The story is there, says Bodcap. There is a story. Oh, 69. I guess physical is really not the answer here. Eat him. Yeah, eat him! Ugh, not yet. Did I play 7R? Yes, I did. And actually, um... Oh, fuck. Wait. Oh, he has, she has a healing rod on. I keep forgetting that. God damn it. Not good. Yeah, they, they're running. I th think 13's the only one this, this time around. Try to eat again. T T no, Tifa's best girl. I, I like I'm absolutely biased. I mean, aren't we all? This guy sucks. I just want to eat him. Yeah, I played the the seven remake and actually, ooh, learned auto life. Learned auto life. So they came out, so I got, I got the 7 remake uh, with PS Plus, like the free version. And for the longest time, they were like, if you got that version, you do not get your PS5 um, upgrade for free, which you would have gotten if you had actually paid for it. But then they switched that. They switched that in... Um, Sometime in December. 
And so last night, downloaded the new version, the upgraded PS5 version, and and my husband started playing it last night. I don't know, I mean, I'm not big into graphics, quality, or whatever. I, I don't know if I can notice a difference unless they're side by side. Um, but maybe it looks better. PS5 is a myth. I mean, it's in, it's in the living room. It's in there. Stone didn't like that. Him. You just bought a switch? Nice. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, Proteus. The only thing good about Final Fantasy XV is you play it. Uh. On what's. Uh, is that essentially saying, like, on the highest graphics settings? I mean, I played 15, just regular. I will agree that uh, I mean, the story was the story was whatever. There was a story. I didn't mind the gameplay, though. I did find it very um Like addictive almost? I don't know. It, it like the flow of the quests and the side quests felt good. Battle felt fine to me. So that's a good miss. <clears throat> what uh what's the first thing you want to play in your Switch, Proteus? You know what would be interesting if, like, say Quinna couldn't eat something. If, if it was like, I can't eat this yet. But instead she was like, I'm just going to take a nibble and um, get some help. Hey, Electro, I see your message. Um, there's a trick to physical attacks in this castle. I'm going to tell you that I'm probably not going to get it. I, I don't usually seem to pick up on those things, and I don't know why. Maybe it's because I'm trying to read chat and play the game at the same time, and so I sometimes don't see everything that happens. Ah, uh, can't eat that. I mean, I've noticed that he doesn't really take a lot of physical damage. Hook. Oh, oh, what does this mean? This means he can eat it with more health. Right? There's a reason you got a crappy weapon in the first dress. Oh, I did see the dagger. Oh, that's not good. Uh, yeah, that was right. Um, so you're saying I should equip the crappy dagger, or at least, like, look at it? The castle has a particular setting. It has a particular setting. Oh my god. Hey, Diesel. Spam some ice. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's true. Like, it's a sacrifice. Oh. It's definitely like a sacrifice you make. 
Like, oh, dead? Are you dead? No. Fuck, what is that? But it's also like a decent excuse so I can be like, oh, I'm doing a shitty job, but it's you guys' fault because I'm talking to you. Oh, why did I try to do that again? Why did I, why did I try to do that again? I know that, that she can't eat that. Okay, but I can't, oh fuck. We just saved right outside, that's fine. I can't um, change my setup in the middle of a battle, right? I mean, that's pretty rad. You can call me spam if that's easier. Oh, I, I, I mean, it's easier. But Sir Spamasum is fun to say. Um, am I using the microphone on my earbud? No. I'm not. Why do I sound bad? No, I sound good. Okay. I know sometimes it gets like almost a short in it and I have to unplug it and plug it back in and that usually fixes it. Oh, I've not. Yeah. Okay. We might just die here and no, we, we did it. Okay, great. Yeah, I do not have, this is not an expensive microphone. Easy win. Yeah, right. That was bullshit. Yeah, yeah, PVP. Did the most damage too, probably. So you are telling me that I should leave. Yeah, I, I'm not mad about my microphone, but I, I do know like there are many, many. Uh, I'm sorry, what? We were playing a game? Oh fuck, we can't leave. What is that? Does this- he's still, like, petrified? Well, someone told me to leave and take a look at the- at the castle, and I can't now. Um... No. A better idea. Wait, because she's... petrified? There is a theme. It is upside down. So... So what? Shitty stuff is good and... Good stuff is shitty? No, you don't get MP. Uh, right, you wanted me to look at the dagger that I picked up? It's not for you. What was, the, what was in the other one? What was in the second chest? Jammies. Uh. So you want me to use this? One of the... Oh, right. Yes, okay. I remember. One of the, like, the symbol-y things. Yeah, okay. Um, we've equipped the shitty weapon. Should I equip everyone's shittiest weapon? I guess these ones matter less because they're not doing so much physical attacking. Hey, Langer. Haven't seen you in a bit. I mean, it's my fault. I haven't been on, so it's my own fault. Happy New Year to you. I hope you had a great holiday with your family. And it's nice to see you. I'm doing very well. Um, obviously back home now, had a good trip home to Canada, um, even though, you know, lots of COVID. 
lots of COVID around, so some of our plans changed, but it was generally good. Oh yeah, online schooling. Okay, so this is shitty weapon. This is shitty weapon. Oh, perfect. We're in a trance. Hey, mind disorder. I hope you're having a great day. Um. So Zidane seemed to do well, but Quina did not. Also, so this castle had like a, an up and a down, right? Or are we saying it's like 100% flipped and like try attacking with Vivi? I mean, I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it next time. Yeah, the trance, trance does not feel very useful, um, especially if it activates like at the end of a battle and then it's just gone and I've done nothing. I've done nothing with it, you know? Okay, hello. Um, how do your kids do with, with, with online school, Langer? Are they okay with it? I know it's really tricky for some, some kids are not into it at all. And, and I hope you're doing well with it. Um, a letter, Kupo. How unusual. I'm so happy. From Mugki to Kumul. Hey, Kumul. How are you, Kupo? Us Moogles? Ugh. Us Moogles and Lindblom are all wondering the same thing these days. Where the heck is Mod Mognet Central? No one knows, Kupo. Do you know where it is, K Kumul? It's supposedly very far away, and you can't enter very easily, Kupo. I heard that you can't enter Mognet Central unless you're riding on a chocobo. Interesting. Do I want to go there? You had to go off work to be home with them, though. Yeah, that's... That is the tough part. That some... Like... They have to be home, so you have to be home with them. Maybe you just buy a couple of these to have them. Oh, we're going up by tens, are we? Sure. It is what it is. You are right. This wave too shall pass. And what, they're home till the 17th or something? This. Is this is a chest? I want that. How do I get that? Cat's claws. 17th as of now, probably longer. Aren't pandemics fun? Isn't everyone having such a good time? Okay, so here's the same battle again. And you want me to try to attack with Vivi. Let's see how that goes. Should I try to attack with, uh, with Dagger too? Everyone's doing a regular attack. So, Quina, not good. Vivi, not good. Zidane, good. <laughs> that was especially bad. Uh... Oh, Langer's... I mean, he can tell you. Langer's from my hometown. 
for field. I don't know if he... I actually don't know where he currently is, if he still lives there. Um, but he is from my hometown. So great and good good and great. Yeah. And that makes awesome. So that totally did nothing to this guy. <gasps> did he just bring the gargoyle to life? Maybe this is a shitty team. Maybe I've made a mistake. still work. Maybe we should, um, remind me that I want to check my abilities after this. I want to check my abilities. I want to check my abilities after this. Okay, let's do it now. I don't know, maybe that's still useful, but we're gonna do that. What do you have? Like, we should get that one on, probably, instead of something else. Oh, we still got... My current physical abilities? What are my current physical abilities? She doesn't have anything helpful. Neither do you. But you have four extra. You have auto regen? That seems cool. Maybe we get rid of level up. Actually, one second. Winna has not yet caught up, so. Is this do? Trance faster. I really want this, but I think it's not the time. I don't know. I'm just gonna pick some. All right, I helped a little. I helped a little bit here. So I put <laughs> current physical abilities include rest eyes and sneeze. Yeah, very good at lounging as a skill. I have that skill. Oh, really? Do people not play Quina? <laughs> I just like them. Just like them. Uh, okay. Sorry. Menuing again. Just 
just a little a little buff there. Okay. Um, this seems like something. No, it's not. Is this something? Yes. Physical abilities. Um, oh, this is... Dead end. Um, maybe there was a down? No down. We just fight again. All right. Thanks for stopping by, Langers. Good to see you, too. Um, hope to catch you live soon. And good, yeah, good luck with your kiddos. We gotta save this. I really do need Quinna to eat more things. Hey, don't be dead. Although I guess I already, I already ate one of these, didn't I? And as the love of food is relatable. Yes. I like them. I like Quinna. Although I feel like I, I have not used them to their maximum potential. Oh. Tastes bad. But. Okay. I don't know where I'm going in here. Oh, I can interact with this. Up or down? Up. No, not up. Down. Okay. Hmm. Is that a ladder? How do I... <laughs> I just feel like I'm like bumbling around on this map. I think I see it though. I think I see where I'm going. Ooh. Well, I want to eat that. Uh. It's an interesting balance because I'm I'm trying not to kill it because I want to eat it, but then I also want to do a lot of damage. Because I want to kill it. Yeah, not time. It's not time yet. Zidane. What's wrong with him there? Is there a way for me to see, like, is he stopped? None of these things. 
I don't know what's wrong with Zidane. And I don't think I have anything to un... Stop him. That missed. He's a giant eyeball and we can't cast blind on him. Oh no. Is Quinn stopped too? Shit. Oh, that was pretty baller. Also noticed in those menus that I can use gems to heal? Like, as an item? To rec- to, like, do HP? Is that a thing that I should- that doesn't feel like a thing I should do. Oh my god. All right, doggo. Burn. Maybe overkill. Maybe overkill. I also- I, sh I think she's learned this and we should switch out her- her equipment. Let's take a look at that. We are getting a lot of gems, though. Gems. Yeah, we gotta do that. Good choice. Now, oh, I think this is a ladder. Oh. these fucks again. Oh, that didn't go well. Okay, this brings the stone to life. I don't know how significant that is. Evie's gonna be out of MP, which is just bad. Eccles is here. she cold. That's a good hit. Damn it. I don't want that to happen.
Oh, let's try this. Ooh, 56. That's fucking expensive. Way too many status effects in this area. Yeah. And I don't seem to have any way to prevent or not even prevent, but just like cure soft. Or not stop, stop, stop is what I meant. What, what stops, stop? What stops, stop? Well, ate it. Ate the gargoyle, didn't do anything though. Does haste stop, stop? Does haste stop, stop? Does anyone have haste? And I feel like hey should stop stop. Here you go, buddy. Is this an elevator? No. Um Oh my god. Uh, the locomotion ability prevents it. Okay, that's just a chest. Is the broadsword... Is the broadsword worse than a dagger? Not for you. That's not for you. What a fucking maze this place is. A javelin. So this is just it giving us all the shit weapons. Okay, and... Going up? No. We're really not going up. I came from down. Should I come from this down? Oh, I can't. I can't get off of it. Did I come from here? Fuck. Oh. Did I come from here? I don't think I can get off there. Oh, I can. Um. Okay, haven't been here, so that's good. This might have been a mistake. Oh, no, buddy. Hey, buddy. You're late, Zidane, and I am the winner. See how much time you lose by working with others? Ah, oh, relax, dude. Have you figured out how to break the seal? Take a look at that wall. Maybe you can figure it out. But it's no longer my concern. What do you mean? I proved myself right. I don't need to follow you around anymore. Y you never had to. Like, wasn't this his choice? We may be enemies next time we meet. See ya. Okay. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> it's his way. We can't change him. Let's get going. Okay, we look at the thing on the wall, I guess? Oh. How do I... Okay, I'm gonna pause here and um, quick wash and break. We'll be right back.
All right, let's touch the wall. Touch the wall. Let's see. There's something written on it. Uh, my power is protected underwater. Underwater surrounded by the earth. Oh. Am I just taking these? Am I supposed to be taking these? Let's see. This one, too. My power is protected high atop a fiery mountain. I guess I'm supposed to take these. Get it? And this one. My power is protected behind a tornado. Wind mirror. That means this one, too. My power is protected under the shaking ground. Uh, okay. Just, uh, you know, casual, casual stealing there. Um, well, looks like we got what we came here for. Let's go. You were staring at that mirror for a long time. Anything interesting? Like Hilda said, those things on the wall must have something to do with the seal. Let's think about it later. We need to get out. Mirror, return to me. Hey, goat. How are you doing today? How was... How was rust yesterday? Who's there? I am good. Oh, fuck. This thing looks like a gross bug. Energy flow. Interrupted. Energy to... Terra, you dare get in the way of Terra's master plan? What is this? My name is Ta Taharka. Taharka, return my mirrors. You should say please when you ask for things. Fool, you'll regret this. Magical as usual. I'm doing very well. Um, we did a lot of chocobo hot and cold today. So much so that. I didn't drink my coffee in time and now it's cold and I don't I don't want it when it's cold. Um so I'm I'm kinda sad. I'm sad about that, but we're actually making star progression now after Choco Choco Boeing. Uh, what do we think this thing hates? Bugs hate fire, right? Co coffee hot and cold, right? I mean it's like you're absolutely correct. Like I came in here and stole his shit and now I'm I'm gonna murder him I guess because I want to be able to do vandalism hey hey sorry I, I have to yell at my dog sometimes um yeah but he's the hideous bug thing of course he's the baddie Oh, prejudice. Yeah, there's no way he's the good guy here. I just, I need to decide, like, how bad do I think he is. Ooh, what does this do? Oh. Oh. Like, really all targets. Ah, oh, we don't have enough. Burn. Is the ding? Oh no, he's ready. He's not stopped. He's ready. I bet you we can't eat that. I should have tried to steal from it, though. Uh, 
I don't I don't know what she should do. She's just gonna hit it. Compact. Yeah. Okay, why do I do that? <laughs> why am I like this? I'm like, yeah, dagger, just do a hit. This thing has a lot of health. throw claws it's honestly probably fine I don't remember who was using those oh no I stole them <laughs> I need to like think more about what I'm doing I stole the claws yay what do I do Burn the bug. You just can't stop stealing, I know. Trance? What does that- what does that mean? For her. Oh yeah, we murdered the bug that we stole from because we're the good guys. Oh, nice, Vivi. The trans was super helpful, aren't they all? Aren't they all though? One, one is all. All is one. You'll never break the seal. Oh, please just auto-exit. Come on, please just auto-exit this place. Don't make me find my way out. I'd be totally okay with yada 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 and getting out of here. Uh, also, maybe, like, I haven't been this way. Oh, is this the way? Maybe this is not a way. Uh, examine. Push. I hope this is a good idea. I, I can't leave it alone. Think. Wait, there is some salt in your future? Uh-oh. to be something. I want that to be something. Wait, are we back to- are we back to talking about gravy?
were you saying something was so gravy, or were you like, so gravy? Tell me, tell me you're having gravy for, for lunch or dinner, meaty bread. Fuck. <laughs> right. Sits and sips gravy. Ah, I'm getting hungry though. Almost lunchtime. Apart from gravy, you know what else is in my fridge? Faux broth. Well, as you can see, Kel. We have entered the castle. So. We are no longer. We are no longer ch chocoboing. I didn't. I, did I give up? I don't think I gave up. Maybe I gave up. Well, we did one. We did one. Chocobo evolved. Very proud. Can do mountains now. Um, and then we proceeded to. Not go to the mountain. Well, I don't have any mountain chocographs, to be honest. Should I leave this thing? I'll- I'm gonna wait, um, like, I'm gonna wait a minute. Not- not a minute, like a figurative minute. And tell me if I can do anything here, or if I have, uh, just keep hitting it? Godcap remembers nothing about this thing. This is now the third time that I have pounded on it. That's four pounds. Oh, very, very helpful. Very helpful, Godcap. Oh, I can now... Are we still doing phrasing? Are we doing phrasing? I really want this to do something. Let's have a think. It says no. Oh, that's a good push. <gasps> Let's try something drastic. Warm up first. Good, good. Uh. Well. Kick. I'm invested in this now. I need this to happen. Just so that Bodcap knows what this does. <laughs> Doing this. Doing this for Bodcap. Maybe we rest. Take a little rest. <gasps> oh, uh, oh. Well, there, there is a chest up here, right? Hey, Katya. I call, do I call you Katya? I know it's like, uh, catty... Ca catastrophe? Katya is certainly not right. All for a high potion. Uh, was that worth it? Correct. Get. Yeah. Wow. I, you know what? I'm let down by that. I am disappointed. But satisfied that we did it. Should I put the barrette on somebody? I kind of wish... Maybe I should have, like, checked that first. Maybe there was meant to be... Like, that's your fast exit. Oh, it opened another path.
Vivi so focused. Worth it? Is focusing worth it? I'm, I've only been doing it like a little bit. Is that is that something I should be doing more? I know it increases magic power, but is it? It's like an increase on the next for like your next spell, right? I also wanted to check this. I think we're gonna do that. Oh no, overall. Overall. Like it it's cumulative, it stacks. For that battle. For the remainder of that battle. Okay, I have been interpreting it a little bit wrong then. I don't think I've gone this way, right? I have not. Rod. Now that. Surely someone can use a rod. Oh, we already had one. Oh, I don't even care. I don't care. I don't remember how to get out of here, though. Uh, formula for focus is... What does Barrette do? What does Barrette do? Who, who wears a barrette? Maybe like here? It is a hair ornament worn by women that raises ice elemental attack. But I think she can't wear it. Oh, unless... right? Can't, she can't wear it. I need to get back into that room. Oh shit. This is wrong. Right? I'm going the wrong way. I'm pretty sure that's the wrong way. This is the remainder of the stream. Lost in a castle. Garnet can can equip it? Does it matter? I mean, does it matter? Like if I I'm not really sure what I'm thinking here. I'm like half thinking out loud, but... Fuck! Should I bring her back? Oh, it would suck to die here. We haven't saved in a long, long time.
You know what? Speaking of that, maybe we throw a safety save here. I'm gonna do it. Okay, I think this is the right way. I just... I just don't... I just don't remember. Can I get off here? No. No. Does this feel right? Yeah, and we just went in a big circle there. I did not... Fuck. <laughs> hey, Garnet Dagger. I'm glad... I'm glad you have made your way here then. Uh, right now I'm lost. Fuck, get on that ladder. Oh, uh, Is it this way? I guess we'll try to go right here? No. No, that's not helpful. Shit. Oh yeah, that's Freckles. That's the Freckles cam. How about that other door? Like, across the way here? Can I go that way? What are we trying to do? We're trying to leave. That's it. I'm just trying to leave, and I'm... I'm, like, really... Like, when I jump off, I go this way, which is not the right way. For fuck's sake. This really didn't feel like it. I mean, I would love to get to that upper one. But I can't get onto it. Uh... How do I get... How do I jump off there? I mean, I... I I thought I came from this way, which makes me feel like this is not correct. Uh, okay, okay, this is right. This is right. This this feels backwards. Like like I'm going backwards. Isn't it, though? I almost didn't even... I almost didn't go for it. Sneaky door. Burn. If the guy sure seems like a dick. But isn't the lore, like, this is not... Ibsen's castle. We just named it after him because he discovered it. But I don't... Is it that right? He didn't live here. So we can't blame... We can't blame Ibsen. Unless you want to. Like, if you're mad that he discovered it, that's fair too. We have to save someone other than ourselves. Um. Well, I mean, the owner, yeah, blame Taharka, but we we murdered them. Although, did we murder them? Like, they 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 dead. They deaded. Like, we won the battle, but then they just kind of like warped into nothing. So that I'm not sure if that meant they were dead. They might not be dead. Oh. Hello, friends. Oh. Hey, are you okay? Yeah, that was scary. Maybe we activated the traps. Oh, no. Is it going to be even more difficult to get out of here? Well, I'm glad you're okay. 
Let's go. They're waiting for us outside. But the traps, though. First things first. Bippy. Ah, the American method. We discover something, plant a flag, and then say it's ours. Sads. Uh, some of the traps are all right. No worries, Brookfield. Have a good meeting. Okay, wait, so you want me to try to walk over some of these things? Like, this looks like a trap. This looks like a trap. Ah, uh, it's going really well. Well, I mean, you say it's been a while since you've been able to hop in here, but... Maiden prayer. What's that do? It's also been a while. Like, I took about a month off. Right, Bibi? So... An item that has a nice fragrance? How do I leave this? Oh, okay. Yeah, I... Hey, curtains. Hi. Um, for the month of December, I went home home. I was in... I was in Canada. So... We did miss. We missed about a month. How did I get here? Is this right? Oh. Wait. Can I go this way now? I did. I had a really good, um, a really good trip home. It had been two years since I'd been there, so it was nice to see people, see my family. Spend the holidays with them. Uh... Air racket. What's that do? You said you took some time off too, baby. Yeah. Oh, this is um. Did anyone explain this castle? Um, it's upside down? I use shitty weapons here. And they're good. Um, that was kind of the gist. Yeah. Yeah, we did, we did that. Except it only really seems to work on, um... I mean, I don't have a shitty weapon equipped on Dagger because they said it... I thought the idea was that for magic users it didn't really matter. Oh, she's on the bed now though, Bibby! And yeah, she seems to be a bit like... Like sometimes she wants it, sometimes she doesn't. But she does that at night too, right? She'll sleep on the bed sometimes, and then jump off and sleep on the floor. She also has a dog bed in the bedroom that gets occasional use. She does whatever she wants. Pretty much. <laughs> but yeah, like, that's a nice dog bed. That's a, that's, that shit's memory foam. She should be into that. Oh. Oh, what is this? I thought also I thought I was supposed to be leaving, but I'm now I'm just exploring more. Golem's flute. Golem's flute did not enter the list. Okay, what are you? Oh no, what is that? What did what did I grab? What 
What's... What are these things? They look kind of like seed pods. What else can I do with it? All right, we have not tried this arrangement yet. Or no, this is the arrangement it was when we came in. Is this a puzzle? This doesn't feel like a puzzle. Xenomorph eggs, that is what they look like. <laughs> I guess that's kind of like what I meant about seed pods, right? It looks like they have like opened. Can I touch the sword? Is this a thing? Is this a thing? Just want to touch stuff. All right, seed pod. Is there anywhere else you can go? Just on these pedestals, eh? Do I have another one? You got shady. All, all while eating tandoori chicken <laughs> with tea from a distance. Hey, yay, yay. Was that? That can't be a serious rally, can it? Or was it like that's in jest? Can I use? I can't use any of these things. I can only use the things near the top. Well, I've put the seed pods in all all positions. I don't know if these are different. I don't know what else I can do with this. Is there any hint in the room? Uh, did I touch everything yet? The sword, there's a big electric sword. There's a circle in the middle. Can I interact with anything else? I got a golem flute from here. I don't know if that means anything. This has like a flower print over the top. That one has a flower print over the top. Wait, try jumping. Can I jump? I can't jump. No jumping, is there? I'm not sure what else I what or what I could replace it with. <laughs> He's Renzo. Obviously. What I was curious about... So these two pedestals do look different. Right? They've got maybe almost a recessed area in the back there. That they, whereas this one's just, like, plain. Um, when I came in, there was one here and then one here. So this is not the original arrangement. There's a specific way to do it. A specific way to... I mean... Oh. I don't think I, I did anything special. To obtain my power, fight against the flow of time. Wait, is that helpful? Fight against the flow of time. Fight against the flow of time. Hey, Lumber Loma. I really kind of wanted him to, like, cast stop. That is fighting the 
flow of time if I ever did it. Cast stop on these two seeds. Fight against the flow of time. It's much simpler. <laughs> what if I take this with me? Oh. Oh, it's a bottle. That's a bottle. The bottle cannot be taken away without its contents. Oh, I didn't know that was a bottle. So... We've learned that. What can we put in the bottle? Am I thinking about this wrong? What don't we like? Well, that's not gonna be helpful. I don't really think I can use items and interact with other items. I mean, that hasn't been a theme of the game, right? How do I fill the bottle? Is that... is that a good thing, Shady? Should I write down that name and look it up later? Why did it take me so long to realize? You fill the bottle by completing the puzzle? Well, shit. I... no, I'm just... I'll just say it. I'm an idiot. I have no idea what I'm doing here. I don't know how to fill a bottle. There's no liquids in here. I just see- I just- I'm just moving it around to different platforms and it's not helping. You fill the bottle by completing the puzzle. The flow of time refers to a clock. So keep moving them counterclockwise? Come on. You know what would have, like, maybe helped? Uh... Putting numbers on the floor? I'm gonna write down that name. I'm gonna write it down, Shady. And then... I'll let you know what I think. Yasha. Yasha Swinney. Dayama. Um, okay, what what did that that put electricity into here? Is that good? I kinda miss that. Ancient aroma. That's it. Is that it? Is that what I came here for? I feel like we're just- we're collecting perfumes in here. That's what this feels like. We got the Maiden Prayer and now we have the Ancient Aroma. Alright. You can use- wait. I can? What is- what does that do? My L1, R1 aren't doing anything. What? Shh. Oh, the item screen. Okay, yeah. Oh, are you tired of me scrolling through the whole thing every time I want to see what's at the bottom? Is that what you're saying? Because I understand that. And you're probably right. No. <laughs> yes. Okay. Now, we did that. That's good. Also feel like this wasn't here before, but that just takes us back here. So that's fine. All right, the eyeball I will fight.
Should I try to, like, trigger another trap? Oh, no. Stopped. I want to deal with that. I mean, none of the chests so far have been good things. They've all been, like, crap. But maybe the new ones... I mean, I know they were intentionally giving you crap. And I get it. I don't want to fight these. It's a nice, quick run away. If there was something very important that you think that I should have grabbed, you can tell me, but going with the story. This is what I would have done without advice. Hey, sorry to keep you all waiting. So Zidane wins this game. What? What happened to Amarant? He was waiting for us at the top um, and left as soon as we got there. I thought he took off. Is he still inside? Is he still inside? Uh-oh. You guys wait here. I'll go I'll go look for him. Oh no. Oh no. He fell through a trap, didn't he? Crap. Am I alone? I said you guys wait here. Oh, I am alone. Uh, this could get really scary. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Fucking run. Zidane's not strong and independent. Oh, right! He has a flea ability! Man. Okay, where do we think this guy went? Probably up here, right? So this is where we last saw him. Yeah, he was in here. Did that go down last time? Did it go up? This is where we last saw him. No trace. No trace of Amaranth here. Let's pick up the scent. Down? Down was the other, other elevator. That took us to the puzzle place, right? This dungeon is great. Is it? Is it? But was there any other way that way? I thought I had um, uh, tried all the the avenues there, as it were. I mean, this. Uh, who's there? Wait, who said that? Did I say that? I don't know, Steph. It's been said that this area is not beloved. I am not beloving it. Oh, fuck yeah, right. Skill, flee. Bye! 
lovely. <sighs> okay. Oh, he dropped money. Unbelievable. Can't believe he's dropping money like that. Doesn't he know we need that to do Chocobo hot and cold? It's like, what was that? 198? How many games of Chocobo Hot Cold is that? I guess it depends where we go. Um. Okay, we're jumping off the pole. Maybe, like, this looks like a trap, but I can't trigger it. This was a way. The dead end way. You know, I'm gonna throw down a save, you know, just while we're here, just just in case. Safety save. The FX <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese. You know, I think Chocobo Hot and Cold. might be like just the best mini game and i am not a lover of mini games as many of you should know like do you know what the worst part of ff7 was Golden Saucer. Hated that. I didn't want to play any of those games. Okay. So. This is the way out. You think he's down here? Wasn't this pretty much like just a room? He's not down here. Where did this go? I can't believe he came back here alone. He's braver than us all. Yeah, we're looking for Amaranth. I don't know where he went. We're, we're running around blindly in the in the dungeon again. <laughs> Dropping money. And we're alone. It's not looking good for our hero. Is this not a door? Why does that look like a door to me? I have no idea. He's not here. Joke's on us. Joke's on us. Amaret actually didn't come back in here. Oh, fuck. I feel alone. Is this how he gets the redemption though? Maybe, let's fall into this trap. I don't remember where that went. Can I go back in the trap? Yes. I didn't have the option to jump into the other hole, did I? Oh no, this is a bad hole. This is not the hole. Not a good hole. Oh. Who's there? 
Is he having a snooze? Zidane, why did you come back? Amaranth, what happened to you? Answer my question. I told you we might be enemies the next time we met. Or did you come back to mock me? You say some strange things. The guys outside told me that you hadn't come out yet. That's why I came here looking for you. We don't have anything to do with each other anymore. You don't have anything to gain from this, or do you? I don't understand you. I don't understand the way you think. Who cares about what I have to gain? You need help right now. You don't care. You're willing to put yourself at risk to save me? Come on, we've helped each other many times since we joined forces. You're a part of the team, that's all that matters. I don't know why I'm doing this, but I can't just walk away. It goes against my nature. I, I would have left him. Personally, I'd have left him. And that's what being a part of the team means? Isn't it? Come on. That's enough talk. Let's get out of here. <laughs> have a great nap, Kel. Thanks for hanging out today. There's no Amaranth in team. Oh my god. Alright, now we leave? Now do we leave? Oh man, Amaranth is actually on the team. Uh, it's been a while. Yeah, I, I'm assuming I'm not gonna keep him very long. Wait, are you- Taco, are you kidding? I mean, I feel like now maybe we know our way around better. Okay, you're kidding. Did you just wanna like see my sadness? You're like, this will be fun. Wait, okay. Okay, whatever. You are not important. Well, he's important. We came back to rescue him, so he's obviously important. But he's not- he's not important. I feel good about this. You know, I feel good that we didn't play Chocobo Hot and Cold for three hours, and we have actually accomplished story. Doom. Oh no. I mean, he's gonna die in 10 turns or 10 seconds. I've never wanted to blow up a castle so badly before. And it's unfortunate because it's really cool looking. You know, it, it looks great from the outside. Just fucking don't, don't enter. Do not enter. Enter at your own risk. All right, listen up, everyone. Let's sort out what we found in the castle. Let's sort out what we found in the castle? Oh, on top of this castle was a mural, a map of the world. There were four mirrors on the mural. This is like spoon feeding, spoon feeding you, right? This is, pay attention, you pay attention, gamer. Um, the writing on the mirrors was in the language only I can read. Oh, I forgot about that. I forgot that was a thing. Um, my power is protected under the shaking ground. My power is protected behind a tornado. My power is protected high atop a fiery mountain. 
My power is protected underwater, surrounded by the earth. And one ring to rule them all. I'm sure the mirrors are pointing us to the locations that help us break the seal. What the monster said before he perished provided us with a clue about the seal. One is all, all is one. Meaning there is a connection between these four seals. Before he perished. Before we fucking murdered him. So what do we do? Are we going to take each location one by one? One is all, all are one. We are going to conquer all four locations at once. Um, we're not going together like we always do? Oh, Jesus Christ, this seems like a bad idea. No, I'm going to drop, drop off two of us in each location. I see. Hey, I'll go with Dagger. Uh, maybe you don't. Okay. <laughs> see you later, Silverhawk. Um, what? Why? It's called Ladies First, Zidane, and we girls have things to talk about. Uh-huh. Is, is that okay with you, Dagger? Sure, but where are we going first? Well, the nearest location would be... One of the locations you mentioned is just south of us. Oh, you were listening to us. I've been a sailor for a long time. I'm confident in my sense of direction. <laughs> hey, fuck. Um... I, I'm really having a great time. Really having a really good time with this game so far. Um, my power is protected underwater, surrounded by earth. The location must have something to do with water. Why not go there first? All right, thanks for your help. Please don't hesitate to ask me if you forget your destination and please remember to equip yourselves properly while we're on board. You can relax, buddy. You're beginning to sound like someone I know. Steve. All right, Aaron, let's go. Yes, sir, now departing. Why do I get to pick four again if we're just... Oh, no, that was, that was a mistake. If we're just um, dropping two off? This is the party. What's wrong with Steve? Um, okay, wait, 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 wait. Big map. It was kind of like here-ish, maybe? This little this thinger? You are not alone, Thug. This is many people's favorite. I don't know, maybe like not maybe not favorite game, but a lot of people's favorite Final Fantasy. So I thought it was kind of here. Have we been here? This looks important. Can I land here? I can't land here, can I? Freckles. Dog is deaf. Hey. Don't do that. Yes, I did just throw something at my dog. Um, I don't know how to get in here. From the top? Can we get in from the top? Can I not land on mountains? Can I land here? Maybe on that grass? Okay, we can get off on the grass. Okay. Um, calling you. We're gonna do a save. Um, I know we got some new people in here today, but this is my normal stream end time. 
Um, I stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday mornings from 9 till noon central. So I will be back on Monday morning and we will go into this place and I guess drop the ladies off. Is that what we're doing? Um, that being said, I hope you all have a really good rest of your Friday and an excellent weekend. And I'm again going to remind you that GDQ starts on Sunday. Um, Sunday around noon, depending on your time zone. So if you're into that, um, be there. Um, we're going to go, we're going to raid somebody. I haven't decided who yet. Um, I'm going to send you over to a, oh yeah, sorry, sorry, Floyd. Yeah, we are done for the day. Um, I'm going to send you over to Melame, who I do not know, but who just started their first playthrough of FF9. Um, this is their day one. So, save the animals. Heck no, save the frame. It's a speed run. Why are you going back to save the animals? I have strong feelings about this. <laughs> um, but yeah, have a good weekend. I'll see you guys Monday, hopefully. <laughs> yeah, you did leave. It's on the stream is ending. All right, let's go spread some love to Mayla May. Okay, bye everybody. I'm actually, I'm just, I'm watching her ad and I, I didn't want to rate her during an, an ad. So that's what I'm waiting for. Awkward delay here. Okay, let's go. Bye. <laughs>